Hi, in this video we'll learn an important property of the optimization problem. If you're going to take the monotonic transformation of the objective in a maximization problem and solve another problem with the transformed objective, then the solution remains unaffected. So to put it more formally, consider the following optimization problems. Maximize fx subject to picking an x from the constraint set C. Another problem is maximizing g of fx where g is a strictly increasing function from R to R and we are making a choice from the same constraint set C. The theorem says that the solution sets of the two optimization problems will be the same. Let us prove it. So suppose x star is a solution to the problem on the left. This implies that fx star is greater than or equal to fx for every x in C. Notice that g is a strictly increasing function. So if fx star is greater than fx, greater than or equal to fx for some x in C, then it must be the case that g of fx star must be greater than or equal to g of fx for that x in C. And since fx star is greater than or equal to fx for all x in C, it must be the case that g of x star is greater than or equal to g of x for every x in C. This tells us that x star is also the solution to the problem on the right. So we have shown that if x star solves the problem on the left, then x star also solves the problem on the right. Let us do an illustration. Consider the following problem. Here we are maximizing xy subject to the budget constraint pxx plus pyy less than or equal to m. Look at another problem where we have taken log of the objective. Since log is an increasing function, so we can rewrite the problem in the following way. It is maximize with respect to xy log x plus log y subject to the constraint that pxx plus pyy less than or equal to m. The result we have just shown tells us that the solution to this problem is going to be the same. Let's look at another one. Suppose we are maximizing x plus y now subject to the budget constraint. The theorem says that if you're going to maximize, if you're going to alter the objective to e to the power x plus y, the solution will still be the same. So this is a very useful theorem to know. There are many examples which can become easier because of using this result. So in this video we have learned that taking a monotonic transformation of the objective and solving the revised problem doesn't change the set of solutions. Thank you.